Well, good morning, everyone. Right now, 747. Valentine's Day is all about making memories with your significant other. But it's also a good time to have some fun and make memories with the little one, too. The little ones. The little and, ones. And here to help us with uh, some ideas on how to entertain the kids and how to have art projects come Valentine's Day is Jan Doyle. And she is from Classroom Connections 365. I love art projects. The kids are so entertained by doing this, and it's a lot of fun. Yes, and it creates uh, imagination and creativity and it stimulates cognitive functioning mm -hmm. and it's just plus it's just fun yeah you know it's just fun yeah so these are some wonderful art projects very simple parents can do this with just about anything yeah look at that yeah this is just um, a kindergarten teacher gave me this this is just folded paper a little heart Put it on the refrigerator. Yeah. How cute is that? And, and you know the thing about this is that parents will keep these forever. Yes, they, they do. They create a folder, and all the whenever kids come home from from school with art projects, they tend to to put them away and then show them to the children, you know, later in life. So absolutely. And if you want a Valentine's Day box or uh -huh. a Valentine's Day card, that's made out of a pasta box. Uh -huh. You can use anything, a cereal box, whatever you have around the house, and you can keep it. And the card inside is from a little second grader in Branford. Oh, look and it's, at that. it's just adorable. You can make your own cards. It, it's just adorable. And then the other thing is, if from you know, Emma. For, yes, from down in front, uh, someone gave me this idea where you can just take a heart, you make a, put a pencil in it. It's mm -hmm. very, very simple, and it could be a little treat at someone's um, breakfast just for the day off. Now, what age group do you well, recommend? Some of these are for, uh, you could do in preschool, mm -hmm. and some are for older. I was asking you earlier about your own child. Mm -hmm. This, and earlier on Channel 8, they've been having man caves and holidays. Yeah. You can make your own candy. That's fun. So maybe you and your wife could do this tonight, you know, make candy for the family. It'd be a lot of fun. So what, do you make chocolate, or, or well, what kind of? that's chocolate, and the reason, the reason a kid is really nice is you mm -hmm. don't have to go look for anything. Everything is in Everything's there. Everything's included. Every, but there's tons where, of recipes. Where, where does one pick up one of these? Any of the craft stores, the sewing stores. It's really a, a great little uh, item to have. But if you don't have time to run out and get that for today or tomorrow, mm -hmm. buy it after Valentine's Day and they'll all be on sale. Yeah. You don't have to do it. You don't do have to it. do it. You Should don't I, have you, to do it tomorrow. You can do it soon. Another thing I love this one is that's, paper that's, weaving. That seems like it's really complex. Well, it really isn't. You take two uh, pieces of construction paper, uh, just kind of make a, U, a shape with a plate, mm -hmm. cut strips, weave it together. Yeah. It's a lot of fun. Do this tonight. You'll never have more fun than this <laughs> in your entire I, life. I think that's a little too complex for me, <laughs> the, the paper weaving. I think mine would be more like this. Oh. Just but, draw, draw a face on it. And then if you really want to make a connection to schools, uh -huh. you can take um, hearts and put a, have the child put on what's different, what's the same. And yeah. these are skills that they need in math and reading. They yeah. compare and contrast. And this is one is same size. Uh -huh. They use this in um, science. So these are activities that they can do in do at home, have fun, you can reinforce classroom skills, Sure. but you're having fun as a family. Yeah, uh, I mean, probably recommended that the parents cut the hearts out and whatnot and then have the kids glue them together. Yeah, depending on the age of the child. Sure. But if you get, to, it, what, a, what a family night that is, getting together and making, this is simple, anybody could do. This is just a pot, Yeah. make something for grandma, put some hearts around it, put in um, some dirt, put in a packet of seeds, and there you have a and, gift. And there you go. And Grandma would probably love that gift forever. Love it. Absolutely love it. Jan Doyle, thank you so much. These are all great ideas. And I hope uh, people at home uh, take it to heart and actually uh, spend some quality time with their kids coming up with great artwork. Thank you. Uh, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Uh, well, everyone, if you want more information on uh, Jan's suggestions, go to WTNH.com. Go to the weekend section, and then uh, you'll have all that information right there for you.